Once he ran to save his life. Now Lopez Lomong runs to save others. When Lomong was six years old, rebels raided his village in South Sudan. They carried him away to a camp for child soldiers. Children were dying of starvation there. Lomong and three other boys crawled through a hole in the fence, and they began to run. If you were like trying to run, you know, for your life, and you know, trying to like either death or or life, you like you, you get kind of try to close your eyes and don't even think about giving up. On a map, Lomong traces the path he ran barefoot through thorns and over stones for three days, clear into another country. All the way through here. You know, through the savanna, through the like woods, things like that, and ended up in Kenya. After 10 years in a refugee camp, Lomong came to the United States. In college, he became a champion distance runner in the 1500 meter race. He became a U.S. citizen. Now his sights are set on the London Olympic Games. I owe this country something. You know, I owe this country uh, a big word of thank you. You know, I want to go out there and be, uh, bring the medal to this country and say thank you to American people who gave me opportunity. But it's not just for medals or for glory that Lomong runs. He started his own foundation in partnership with the international Christian relief group World Vision to help bring education, clean water, health care and better nutrition to his homeland. It's so difficult to see young kids like, you know, girls walking five, six, seven miles to go fetch the water instead of going to school. Lomong has helped to raise $100,000 so far. His goal is for half a million by next year. Even as Lomong trains for the London Games here in Oregon, his thoughts are very much with his family back in South Sudan, a country once again on the brink of war. To see that being boiling again and people like in the border still like suffering and you know, refugees is still good, not now like fleeing more than ever. It's just like, what? why? Whether he wins in London or not, as soon as the games are over, Lopez Lomong is going back to South Sudan to lend a hand to those in need. If I just do this running for myself, then I, I, I should just stop because I do this for to be able to inspire people. Rob Reynolds, Al Jazeera, Beaverton, Oregon.